A tropical heat wave in Anaheim last Sunday sent the temperature up and the fans' inhibitions down. But the story of this Browns-Rams game was written on the playing field, where Cleveland quarterback Paul McDonald autographed the word interception all over this first quarter pass. Leroy Irvin's 81-yard touchdown run with McDonald's errant toss gave the Rams an early 7-0 lead. But McDonald managed to collect himself, and slowly he brought the Browns back in a fashion reminiscent of his predecessor, Brian Sight. With the help of former Dolphin wide receiver Duriel Harris, number 84, McDonald completed 18 of 35 passes for 263 yards. And with his much improved passing game, complemented by a rushing attack led by Mike Pruitt, number 43, Cleveland took a 17-10 lead into the final quarter. All day long, the boos normally reserved for the opposition were showered upon Ram quarterback Vince Ferragamo. But just when it appeared that L.A. might go down to their second straight defeat, Ferragamo rallied the Rams to two fourth-quarter scoring drives, one that resulted in this game-tying touchdown toss to Olympic gold medalist Ron Brown and another that ended with a Mike Lansford 27-yard field goal that gave L.A. a 20-17 victory. While the Rams signed and sealed this come-from-behind victory with a strong hand of support for their beleaguered quarterback, Walter Payton of the Chicago Bears continued to make his mark on the NFL record.